Carlita, what's she doing, baby? She's like pushing an office chair over there. What are you doing, sweetie? Good morning. It is a random Thursday, which means it's trash day. Oh, sucks. Trash day is like, oh, trash day sucks when my husband is at work. <laughs> So I thought I would do a little what I eat in a day. Um, I will say that if I did this again tomorrow, it would be probably completely different. Every day is a bit different because if you've been here for a little while, then you know, but if you haven't, welcome. Um, my husband's a firefighter, so he will be gone at work for a minimum of 24 hours at a time. Currently, he is on his second of three days of work, so he is not coming home until the day after tomorrow. So with my husband, he has to have his veggies, his starch, his meat, and I could just eat a random smorgasbord of bullshit that I pulled out of the fridge that's like a handful of this, a handful of that, a couple fucking almonds, a pe like piece of toast, peanut butter, a couple radishes, a string cheese, and we're good to go. But that is not okay when my husband's here, so today is going to look a lot different than it is a couple days from now. So, uh, today we're just going to be, you know eating what I normally would eat, what I have in the fridge. I think I might stop by the grocery store for a couple things after the gym. Um, typically, I will have my Nespresso first thing in the morning. Y'all know I'm obsessed with my Nespresso machine. I've been only doing decaf, but supposedly you're not supposed to have caffeine first thing in the morning. You should wait an hour after you wake up and you should have water first. So I'm gonna be drinking this. I drank this whole thing yesterday and then filled it up a little bit more. And this is what I had left over after filling it up again. So, um, well, I filled it up like halfway. So I'll fill this entire thing up. I got this on Amazon and it has been really useful for me. Not, I just like all of my water in one place that I know I need to drink throughout the day. Um, so if this is for you, if you like something like this, I'll link you guys, but I just loved the colors. It's like a mermaid. Um, Nick put this beautiful sticker on my water. Um, definitely an inspiration to work out. So I'm gonna drink a little bit of water and then I'm gonna make my Nespresso. And I've been back going to the gym now, trying to hit like four or five days a week, kind of back at that whole thing. The dogs are like making out over here. It's so cute. That is reflected in a little bit of what I'm eating. I'm really trying to like get a handle on portion control this year. I've realized last year being pregnant and stuff, I was just eating larger portions as you do when you're pregnant. But even before that, I felt like I was just eating bigger portions and I love food. So I would tend to eat larger portions of a dish that maybe a family member made because it's so good and it's not that healthy and I really need to manage my portion control. So I would just keep eating when I wasn't hungry. So anyways, this video is not about like healthy eating or not healthy eating. It's literally just like no bullshit what I'm gonna eat today. I'm not gonna like make anything special for the camera. I'm gonna make things that I make on a weekly basis and I just have already. These are like staple items that I basically just keep in my house. So let's go ahead and get started with that. I'm gonna go ahead and make myself an espresso. You dumped out all the pictures. You dumped out all the pictures. What are you doing? Can I have that plastic bag? I hear that that's not good for kids to play with. Can I have that? I have that? Thank you. Boop, 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 boop. This is the chosen one. The reason why I drink decaf is there's a few reasons, but mostly it tastes the same to me and um coffee doesn't really i don't notice it affect me maybe it does but i don't notice it i don't need to pick me up right now this is just my morning ritual so whether it's decaf or not i feel like it's a little bit of a placebo because i could drink decaf or a full cup of coffee and just feel the same but nick does think i get wired so maybe there's something to it oh that doesn't turn what the hell what do you want like a morning shot just got some new goodies from Mexico. Ah, come help mama make coffee. Wanna well, come help mama make coffee? Oh huh, baby? Come here my pretty girl. Uh, did you see? Did you see? Your new 
car seat is sitting out there in that box. You got a brand new one. It's gonna turn towards the door. Oh, little snot nose. Oh, is you gonna let mama wipe your face? She's like, no way in hell, bitch. Oh, the moment it hits your lips. Ah, it's so good. It's so good. She's looking at me like I have lost my damn mind. Does everybody's kid hate that? Like, why is it so terrible? Why does my hair look so yellow in the camera today? done and going to the gym today. I'm gonna get a pedicure. I'm gonna get gels in my toes for the first time I think ever. It just chips off so fast so hopefully the gels is, is good. Also take a look at all of this. Tanologist is so awesome. They sent me all this stuff. I'm so excited to not be pale anymore. Thank you guys so much for sending me so many tanning products for the greater good so I can be not pasty anymore. breakfast is ready. I would actually have some turkey bacon with this, but I am out, so I'll probably stop by after the gym to get some. But that's a little avocado that was left. Sometimes I put cucumber under, like on top of the avocado too. And sometimes some sprouts, but the sprouts that I was growing up here like got moldy or some shit, so we can't eat those. <clears throat> I gotta mix, I gotta grow some new ones. But this egg is a little more cooked than I usually like it. I usually like it kind of runny, but that will be our breakfast before the gym. I'm making a protein shake for the gym to take with me after my workout. I basically finish my weights and then take my protein shake to my cardio machine. This is um, supposedly expired in 2020, but I don't think protein powder goes bad, so it's like plant-based protein powder as well. So we're gonna keep, we're gonna keep on keeping on. Oh, the temptation. So with my new diet, I still will indulge a little here. I shouldn't say diet. I'm just being conscious of what I'm putting in my body, but I still think that you need to eat some things that you like every now and then. So um, moderation, that's why I have clips on this. Old me would have literally eaten this entire bag and now I sometimes break it up and forth. Aren't you proud of me? I'm proud of me.
just got my nails done. They look so cute. I got my toes done. I got some, um, I got some gel on my toes because it's always peeling off. So I brought some snacks. It's a little late right now, but I've got a Go Macro bar and I've got some pumpkin seeds. So I'm gonna eat these. I'm gonna head to the grocery store in a little bit. I'm just craving the shit out of some banana pudding. So, not sure if I'm gonna make that tonight or tomorrow, but uh, I love pumpkin seeds. This one brand from Vons tastes the most like homemade pumpkin seeds from any of the ones from the store. You know what I mean? They're like that and not like this big, chunky, fat, weird white ones. Anyways, for my snack, on the way to the grocery store, grab a couple little things and then probably eat a lunch right when I get home because it's already like two o'clock and I am starving. Here's how we're doing on water intake. We're at 3 p.m. right now. So we, oh, dude, this thing always splooges all over me. There was no, it usually does that when I go like up in the mountains or down or whatever and it just like went all over me. It must've been the heat. So we're doing good on water. Um, this is the coconut and almond, coconut, almond butter, and chocolate chips. I wish Go Macro would sponsor me because these bars are not the cheapest, but they're so good. Like, they're the, like one of the only protein bars that I like. So, anyways, that's what we're doing right now. Okay, here's what I need, but I also need stuff for banana pudding, so I'll get this stuff first. None of these look right. And where's the organic ones? Ooh, these just like look really good. I don't know if you guys know this, but the feta that's in a block like this tastes like a hundred times better than this. This stuff usually has cellulose in it. These are definitely not on the list, but they look flippin' delicious. So, yeah. Actually, they kinda look a little freezer burnt. I think I already have some of these in my freezer. Not this brand, but veggie ones. I'm not, I wanna try these, though. I'm pretty sure everyone in the store thinks I'm talking to myself. <laughs> no big deal, I kind of am. a bit of a late lunch, but this is what we're having right here. Um, I'm gonna put some dressing on this. Actually, let me get that. This is like my favorite dressing in the whole world, other than ranch. This is the only other thing I will have besides ranch. That on there, and these are like literally the driest looking carrots I've ever seen in my entire existence. They look like they're about to shrivel up and give up on life, but we're gonna try those anyway. This is plain Chobani Greek yogurt with some fresh raspberries and some radishes. I just like to eat these like apples. Anyone else? This is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna see how I feel. Um, I'm usually still hungry after I eat this because this is literally like healthy rabbit food. But um, if I am, then I will figure something out. <laughs> I also forgot about this. So this is from our avocado tree. This is from our Haas tree. We have three avocado trees. So this will be the first avocado that's like ripe that I didn't cut into too early to try and I'm bummed that Nick's not here for this so maybe I should film eating this on my phone and send it to him but let's try this guy out <gasps> dude that looks so good I think the camera's like cutting off some of my head Oh, my extension started to hurt up here, so my hair like is so greasy and stuff, so excuse that, but I had to take it off. Do you hear the bullfrog? Homie, the sun is still out. Okay, I'm so excited to try this avocado, you guys. 
It has been my dream to have my own avocado trees. I eat avocados like it's going out of style. He's back. <laughs> so cute sounding. I have like a special spot in my heart for frogs. I used to, um, well, like, like, I feel like collected something when we were little. Some people was cow stuff. Some people was like fruit things. Sometimes it was like a TV show. I collected frog stuff, like frogs are my jam. But okay, I'm, look at the green on this. Like I am, I'm so proud that we grew this. I mean, I bought like little stuff to go over the tree when it was cold. When it's cold, it's still winter. Oh, let's try this. Oh, it's like the perfect consistency. Mm. Oh my goodness. It is so good. I'm so excited. So I bought this tree when I was pregnant last year and a lady told me that none of the blooms on it would really turn into anything and they would just fall off. Well, she was wrong. Mm. For dinner, I'm gonna eat some riced cauliflower stir fry. This is super easy to make. I'm not sure this is the normal one I get because the normal one I get, I don't think has ginger in it, but rice cauliflower. And then I'm going to do two fried eggs on top. I am trying to basically finish all of my food by 7 PM and not eat after 7 PM. So let's see how fast I can make this. This is usually really fast, which is why I decided to make this for tonight. So let's See how we do it. If I'm still hungry, I will make um, a veggie patty to go with this. <laughs> you hear? <sighs> I'm also multitasking. It looks like I've smeared like a light layer of peanut butter on my face, but this is a little um, exfoliating mask. That wraps up what I had today. If I get hungry in a little bit, I will probably just go to bed. Um, I'm trying to stick with not eating past seven, like I said, so I did pretty good today. Um, yeah, that's, that's like, I mean, every day is a little bit different, but like some staples for me are string cheese, pumpkin seeds, a hard boiled egg, strawberries, and then my, yogurt with raspberries and honey. Those are kind of like, and the protein bars. So kind of like my staples right now. Sometimes a little bit of cottage cheese as well. So that's kind of like, it's my day in a nutshell, guys. Um, every day it'll be a little bit different. And you know what I did do today? I signed up for, I think it's Green Chef is the one. Do you guys think I'm gonna love that or hate it? I thought it would be, nice to try out because like the way that I eat is a little different than the way Nick eats. He likes like full meals and stuff. So I thought it might be nice to just like have everything delivered right to me because as you know, if you are a mother, even if you're not a mom, but add a kid in there and it makes it even more difficult or multiple kids, going to the grocery store like multiple times a week or one time to shop for everything can be a little confusing. But I did want to share an app with you guys. Um, this is not sponsored, but a friend told me about this app the other day. It's called Jow, J-O-W. And you put in there how many people you are cooking for and how many days a week, and it will spit out recipes at you. And then you can choose a different one, or if you're like, oh yeah, those three look good, um, it'll make you a shopping list too. So you know everything you need to buy. And I think what they do is they, I've only used it once, but I think what they do is they like make sure the ingredients are similar for all three dishes so that you don't have to like, 
buy and be wasteful. So pretty cool app um, from what I've seen so far. So definitely check that out if you're interested and kind of don't want to go like a green chef route or if, you know, whoever, whatever. Maybe it'll just, maybe, maybe it'll be helpful. Maybe it won't. Um, and to those of you that voted no for this video on Instagram, if you're still watching, then did you really not want to see this? Because if you're still here, I mean, you know what I mean? All right, we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. This is Kristen from the next day. I meant to eat this yesterday and I forgot. So let's just pretend I ate this yesterday because I really do eat some things that I want to eat in moderation. So I'm gonna eat this right now. I'm even eating it before breakfast. So, what I used to do is open one of these, just eat all of it. Cause like, I already kind of ruined my day, right? I already ate a little bit, so I might as well eat the whole thing. No. Just because I have something tasty doesn't mean I need to eat the whole candy bar. Moderation is what we're practicing. White chocolate cookies and cream. Mm. I'm gonna make that banana pudding today or tomorrow as well. Got everything for that. Mm.